Fabian Elizondo and today I've been given the opportunity to introduce our Chevy Silverado Max Trailering Package. Now before I go into our Max Trailering Package from the Silverado, let me give you a, a quick history. Uh, the Silverado uh, came up from a, quite a bit of trucks of successors. Start off with the AK uh, series, then it led to the, the Task Force, and then the Chevy CK. And then that's when Chevy came out with something amazing. Back in 1998, that's when Chevy first released the Chevy Silverado. Now the Silverado has gone through quite a few generation changes. First one was from 1999 up until 2006. From 2007 was the second generation up until 2013. During this generation though, that's when Chevy kind of went away from something. They went away from the manual transmission in 2008. That's one thing that uh, that differentiated us from the other ones. Reason being is because they carefully calculated uh, the, the computer that way it can shift perfectly. By shifting perfectly, that means there's no need for a manual transmission. Uh, in 2013 and 2014 was when the Ecotec 3 was introduced. The Ecotec 3, what this engine provides is a direct injection, variable valve timing, and it's also gonna add the active uh, fuel management. Those three things alone is what makes this engine a lot more special than our competitors engines. The reason being is because with the variable valve and direct time injection it's going to give you the maximum power and save gas at the same time and the active fuel management is what's going to downshift that eight cylinder down into a four cylinder which ultimately it's going to lead into better gas mileage. That's one thing that Ford nor the Dodge Ram can offer you guys that this, that this uh, engine actually can offer you guys. 2014 and up was when the, four, the third generation and 2016 that they did change the body style. But this year what we have in front of us is a 2015. Now this engine right here with the Ecotec 3, since it, it's going to be working a lot harder than your standard engine, there's a reason why GM contracted with Dexos. So with Mobile One Dexos, the OEM specifications that this engine needed, it did need to be a synthetic engine oil. That's the reason why it's a 0W2 weight on the oil that we're using on it, just to keep up with that performance on this engine. This one does have a lot more safety features. Uh, we have the crumple zones if you get on a head-on collision, it absorbs most of the impact. Uh, this one also has an enhanced uh, cooling system for the, for the vehicle as well. Uh, to prevent overheating since this vehicle is meant to be towing that's the reason why we want to upgrade our uh, cooling system we do use the dex cool as well the dex cool fluid that we use is good for five years 150,000 miles ford on the other hand they use a motorcraft gold antifreeze the gold antifreeze is good for about 60 to 80,000 miles that one's also about two years long so that's what's going to show us dif the difference in even the antifreeze that we're using on our truck uh, this vehicle as well is going to be a six-speed transmission uh, Ford is also going to use a six-speed transmission and Dodge is actually going to have an eight-speed automatic transmission So that's going to be the differences from Ford and also from Dodge and Compared to our vehicle now this vehicle here as well. It's going to be your LT convenience package What that means is you're going to get your fog lights you get your chrome grill on this one as well and You get your party carbon polycarbon headlamps this one does come with the 20 inch aluminum rims as well. On this vehicle, it does come uh, standard for the max trailering package as well. You get your extendable mirrors. These mirrors right here are meant for towing, but they can also slide out, slide back in. If you turn your cargo lights on, your lights, they light up your whole side area as well. Uh, so in case you're towing, uh, you can put your lights out. The lights, they flash on the inside. So if you have people next to you driving around you for safety reasons, that's the reason why, why uh, Chevy included these mirrors. Uh, Ford does have these as well, uh, but that's going to be one of the things that, uh, that uh, well actually the Ram has that as well. Uh, but these is what's going to make it more special on the Max Going Pack. Now this one here, it is a 1500. It's not your 25, it's not your 3500 on this vehicle. Uh, compared to uh, the other vehicles, they do tow a little more, but this one is meant for towing on a light duty truck. So that's the reason why uh, but we brought it down to uh, the 1500 with the Mac trailer pack. Now, if you guys head back here, uh, some of the other features that we added on this vehicle is you have an automatic drop. So it automatically drops down uh, in case you're going to be towing. We also did add the camera as well. With the camera, you can actually see behind you. That way, it makes it a lot easier when you're backing up to guide yourself uh, so you'll be able to tow. Uh, this towing, uh, it's where your tow hitch is at. You can put uh, several different types of tow hitches on this vehicle, depending on the type of load that you'll be carrying for this vehicle. We also have connections for the trailer with this trailer as well. 
Uh, it's a lot better and I'd actually recommend connect the, the trailer in the electric because that way you can get to control your brakes, you get to control your lights. Uh, so when you're towing, it makes it a lot easier and a lot safer to apply brakes. Uh, this one is equipped with the, with the automatic brake braking system as well. So if you hit your brakes in there, it's going to hit the brakes on your trailer. That's if it is connected properly. You've got your spare tire as well. Uh, one of the things that makes this one different from any other one is you do have your 373 gear ratio. What that means is we put a bigger gear inside of that axle. That way it gives you more power to tow. But you can't just add a bigger gear ratio and expect to tow more. Just like if I was to work out, I can't just work out my arms and expect my bench to jump up. So, maybe actually a lot, a lot more things into this vehicle. We did put the leaf springs as well. We put the heavy duty leaf springs because if you are going to be towing a lot of weight, you're going to need to upgrade those springs. We put a revised shock suspension on this one as well uh, for increased control and also for better, uh, for better handling on these vehicles. Because if it is going to be carrying a lot of weight, we prefer that you're safe out there, you're reliable, and then you don't have to call 1-800 Chevy USA in case of an emergency. But just in case, we still give you that warranty, that peace of mind. Uh, you do get five years, uh, 100,000 mile powertrain warranty on this vehicle, and you also get five years, 100,000 mile roadside assistance. You get a flat tire on this vehicle, uh, you run out of gas, you, uh, you need a locksmith, you need the vehicle towed anywhere, or if you need your battery jump started, you just call 1-800 Chevy USA, you have that peace of mind that you can just call us, we'll unlock the vehicle. But this vehicle does come equipped with a MyLink application as well, so if you do get locked out, you can actually, by the push of a button, unlock your doors, or you can even start up your vehicle. The MyLink application is good for about five years on this vehicle. That's going to be one of the benefits that we're going to offer that our competitors will not offer you as well. Connectivity on this vehicle, you get your Bluetooth, you get your uh, aux cords as well, you get XM radio, and you also get uh, you also get your OnStar, which all comes equipped. OnStar is good for six months. Uh, this vehicle comes with a three months as well, three gigabytes of Wi-Fi certified. So you get all of those uh, extras that you won't see on the other vehicles. Uh, another thing that this vehicle has here is uh, this vehicle does have 380 horsepower, 383 foot-pounds of torque. Uh, giving it a lot more power, but if you were to upgrade this engine into the 6.2 liter, the 6.2 liter actually has 420 horsepower with 460 pounds of torque. So the 6.2 can actually tow 12,000 pounds. Uh, this one, the 5.3, actually tows 11,100 pounds. Our competitors, such as Ford, Ford has 385 horsepower. 387 foot-pounds of torque, but the Ford 5.0 can actually tow 12,200 pounds. Uh, Dodge, on the other hand, Dodge actually has uh, 395 horsepower and 400 pounds of torque, but the, the Dodge can only tow about, 11, about 10,900 pounds. So there's a lot more difference uh, that this vehicle, it's actually stronger, better, has your automatic uh, rear locking differential, uh, they actually did a test where it was going up the hill and it was spinning out on uh, some rollers and with the automatic uh, locking differential that Chevy has, it actually locked it, cut the gears and actually made it up at ease. The Ford also has a locking rear differential but theirs is not automatic, theirs you have to push the button. So by the time you realize that you, you need to press the button, it's a little too late, you won't even need the button anymore. Uh, Dodge on the other hand, they fell behind, they don't have that kind of technology. Now, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Fabian Zondo. This is the 2015 Silverado Max Trailer Package.